Welcome to your new Pure Vision HD stove. Whether you are new to stoves or a seasoned user, please follow the guidance as all stove brands and models perform differently. To open the door, pull the handle up and pull the door back. The door is self-locking, so to close the door, you just need to push the handle with the palm of your hand and the door will latch itself. Do not pull the handle up when pushing the door back in. Please remember to wear the high quality safety gloves provided when opening and closing the door. It is of the utmost importance that you use good quality kindling and fire starters. Here we are using Flamers starters with kill dried kindling. Don't use newspaper as this will create soot in your stove. Set up the kindling on top of one or two small logs. We recommend that you set the kindling similar to a game of Jenga, as shown here. Place the flamer in the middle. Before lighting, push the control lever fully to the left for wood burning and fully to the right for solid fuel. Light the kindling and close the stove door. After approximately 8 to 10 minutes, add a further two small dry logs, approximately 9 inches long. This will vary dependent on your flue and fuel. At this point the liners are cold and they will soot up. This is normal, don't panic. Continue to have a very hot fire. Leave a fully to the left if wood and fully to the right if solid fuel. Do not move the air control lever until the liners have returned to their original colours, which takes approximately 45 minutes to an hour. Once the liners are back to their original colours, the stove chamber is now thoroughly hot enough so you can adjust the air settings. The following steps will vary dependent on your individual flue draft. Slowly pull the air control lever towards the middle of the stove. Moving the lever into the middle position effectively shuts the stove down. Work the controls gently out towards the left for wood or right for solid fuel until you find your desired flame picture and efficiency. On solid fuel, it is likely to be near the maximum for quite a long time. The stove will now burn slowly and beautifully with gentle dancing flames. Only refuel the stove when the stove is ready. The perfect time to refuel your stove is easy to spot and very visual. You will notice that the logs are glowing orange and the flames have died down. At this point, you can now open the stove door wearing the protective gloves provided. You will notice very little smoke and ash at this time. Wearing the gloves supplied, take your poker or ash rake from your Pure Vision companion set and gently tap the glowing orange logs to create a bed of hot charcoal and ash. For the PV5 freestanding and inset stove, add one large 9 inch log which will be sufficient. For the PV5W and PV85 freestanding and inset stoves, add two 9 inch logs side by side. Pick up the logs and gently place the logs into the centre of the stove, keeping them away from the liners and glass. Gently close the stove door with the palm of your hand. Do not pull up the handle to close the door as it will not close properly this way. Move the air control lever fully to the left for wood and to the right for solid fuel. Your new fuel should ignite within 10 to 20 seconds. When the log reignites, move the control lever back to the cruise running position you had chosen. This position is dependent on preference and flue draft, which will vary from home to home. One large log should last approximately one hour with attractive flames 
if you follow this cycle. Please repeat the steps previously described for further refueling. When closing down the stove for the evening, push the control lever fully over to burn the remaining fuel off highly efficiently. This ensures the glass and the liners stay clean. Next time you use the stove, wipe the glass with a non-abrasive cloth and a little water or general glass cleaner. Provided you are following the previous operating instructions, there should be very little cleaning to do. There are only really three things that can go wrong with your stove. Firstly, the operator. Please understand your own stove's best operation. This varies widely from stove to stove and brand to brand. Secondly, the fuel. Use the correct quality seasoned or killed dried wood from a reputable supplier. Unfortunately, many unscrupulous suppliers claim that the wood is dry and ready to burn when it's not. Moisture content should be between 5 and 20%. Anything over 20% will create excessive tar, soot, smoke and carbon and will not produce heat. We would recommend that you purchase a moisture meter to test your wood. These start from £20 and are well worth the investment. Thirdly, the flue system. It is important to understand with a modern stove that heat loss through the baffle plate and spigot is minimal, no more than 20%. Therefore, we would strongly recommend a quality flue liner system. This is because a 5 or 6 inch liner is far easier to warm up and ensures your stove is working at an optimal level sooner. However, it is usually perfectly safe to use without a liner, provided it is professionally installed and checked of course, but it may take a long time to warm up with each use and affect the control and performance of your stove. Following these simple steps will ensure a lifetime of enjoyment and performance from your new Pure Vision HD stove, with the safe knowledge of the 12 years warranty as a backup. Thank you for purchasing a Pure Vision HD stove. For further advice and product news, please visit our website at charltonandgenric.co.uk.